What is up YouTube? It's your boy Dem. Um, today is not a Pokemon video, but it is a Yu-Gi-Oh video and I'm going to be using my favorite deck, Karibo. We're not going to be playing any ranks, we're just going to be playing some quick games so we can go by fast and battle. I just want to play around like three games, but you know what? Nonetheless, we're going to have some fun and maybe, you know, in the future you guys can tell me what I can do better with my deck, what deck you want me to use, and, um, you know, I can become a better Yu-Gi-Oh player that way and you guys can teach me something, but today we're using Karibo, so you, let's get this first match started. <sighs> let's see how it's gonna go. And if you're wondering why I have so many toys in the background, it's because I do have kids. I have two kids. I have a boy and a girl and another girl on the way. And I'm so excited. And let me select my deck. Karibo. And I am ready. Whoa. I've been disconnected from the server. Okay. Well... Let's try it one more time. Let's join the duel. How's everyone's morning going? Leave it in the comments. Um, I just worked at Braveguard. I do still have a full-time job, so grateful for that in this uh, pandemic. But it's Braveguard is killing me, and now I'm trying to make these videos, but I love making these videos, so I'm gonna do it for the love and for myself. And I opened up with the best hand ever. I got my Karibo and my Multiply. So this is my main combo of the deck. So you'll see I summon Karibo. And then I activate Multiply. I tribute Karibo. And then I get the five Karibo tokens. There you go. And then I link him away. And the end goal is Avarax. So then I special summon... Uh... Apprentice Witchling, Link Away 2, Summon her, Special Summon again, and then I'll get Unicorn, right there, and then, no, and then I Special Summon one Link Karibo, Special Summon him, and then I Link Away for Avermax, crazy combo, crazy, crazy combo. And then <laughs> Link Karibo activates in the graveyard, and then I special summon him to the field, and I will end my turn. I wish I was going second. Um, it's a very easy OT here with uh, Aberbacks on the field, but it's okay. We're having fun. This is my Karibo deck. Um, I did not build this deck, to be honest with you. I did get the... I got the deck profile from another YouTuber, I can't remember off the top of my head. I'll probably put his uh, tag right here once I find it after editing and playing these games and stuff. But very, very good deck list and <laughs> if this guy special summons five or more just like how I did, I got Nibiru in my hand, it's gonna nuke the whole field, well nuke his field basically. and then. You know, then we got two, th the two, three thousand monsters on the field, and that'd be game. <sighs> so this will be my second video in a row, because I posted one yesterday, or I think I posted this morning, so I'm going to try to post this video today. I don't know if I'm going to be posting videos every day. Um, I'm just still trying to get into the flow of things and like I said, I do have a full-time job So um, I'm gonna be posting whenever I'm free and like I said my next video will be The second part of the Roaring Skies box opening I wanted to post this today because I wanted to show you guys that I play Yu-Gi-Oh! And it's not just gonna be a Pokemon channel and that I want to grow with you guys and that if you guys do play Yu-Gi-Oh, I want to play with you. So let me know if you play Yu-Gi-Oh. I'm usually on Dueling Nexus, but if you want me to get YGO Pro, I'll get that too because I know a lot of people play that. A lot of people play Duel Links. I don't have Duel Links. Maybe I should start playing Duel Links. But as of right now, I'm mainly on Dueling Nexus. So if you do want to play with me, it is DemTCG. 
same as my YouTube name, and you know, we'll hop on Discord and have some fun together, and um, still waiting for this guy to uh, finish his turn. Who does he got on the field? Encode Topper, okay, okay. Should I, I'm gonna Nibiru him. Should I Nibiru him? Wait. During the main phase, if your opponent controls a monster this turn, you can treat as many phase of monsters as the field as possible if you do special summon this card. Uh, let's not Nibiru him. Because I have Avermax on the field and Link Karibo, so if he tries to attack, Link Karibo's spec goes off. I take no damage. And when Avermax uh, battles a special summoned, uh, I was about to say Pokemon. A special summon monster. Um, his attack is ha at like, um, let me read it to you. Uh, while this Link Summon card is on your field, your opponent can't target this card with card effects. Also, the monsters cannot, uh, cannot target monster attack except this one. Uh, let's know. Except this one. And. Once per uh, once per battle during bad, uh, damage heckling, if this card battles a special summon monster, you can make this card gain attack equal to that opponent's monster during the damage calculations. So let's say I attack his I attack his Inco Talker, his Inco Talker t attacked me. My attack will go up to fifty three hundred, and you know he'll take. A lot of damage and <laughs> that's why Abermass is such a crazy card and it's so easy to get out with the Link Karibo or the Link Karibo, Karibo combo which is if you start with Karibo and multiply you're pretty much set uh, you also run um, Black Luster Soldier and Chaos Dragon in this deck so it's mainly like all my monsters are light and dark so they're easy to pop off and I love this deck Karibo is my favorite deck that I play with and I'm sorry guys, I'm, sorry, I'm trying to see, trying to talk to you guys and see what's going on. Uh, let's not do it. I have not even been paying attention to the duel. He has two link monsters on the field. I don't know. I'm kind of scared. I don't know what's going on right now. So I'm over here talking to the camera. But I think we're gonna get the win on this. You know. We're seven minutes in. Oh. oh. Okay. Access code topper. I think with this one he can banish. You can banish one link monster from your graveyard, destroy one uh, of your opponent's monsters. Of course he's gonna banish and destroy my Avermax and uh we're gonna, we're gonna have his effect pop off. And then he, uh, uh, foolish word to the grave or bear to the grave. And you know what? Let's, let's Nibiru because he destroyed my monster. I'm gonna destroy his monster. There you go. There you go. That's what he gets for banishing my Abermas. He had a hand trap, I had a hand trap. It it just worked. So what we're gonna do. You know, we're just gonna summon this Karibo. And then I'm gonna activate Link Karibo in the graveyard, tribute him. Another another one, okay. It's hand traps, man. So I guess I'll just go to battle phase, attack the token. He takes no damage, I take no damage. And I'll end phase and let's see what he has next. So, you know, like I was talking to one of my coworkers and I was asking him, um, what's the easiest way to edit a video? Because I'm new to editing as well. 
and um, I needed to learn how to do a specific thing in my video editor, and he told me the easiest way to do that. The, the, thing, the thing I had to learn how to do was overlay videos because I don't I don't stream. It would be the easiest way for me to do it as streaming just to have the overlay, you know, the screen in the corner and the game that I'm playing. But I don't stream, and I know I should just get the streaming system like OBS or something. So it's easier for me to do that. But I'm I'm hard headed. I'm gonna do it the hard way. I'm gonna go into my video editor overlay the videos and all that because I like work. <laughs> no, yeah, I don't. Oh, he surrendered. Why did he surrender? So we're going to take that win, you know, 10 minutes in. We're going to take that win. He surrendered. I don't know why he surrendered. We were both at 8,000 life points, but you know what? Let's move on to the next duel. And here it is. Uh, if it let me select, move to duel list, move to duel list, move to duel list. Move to duel list. Uh, and I'm ready. I don't know, <laughs> that was weird. I was like, I had two windows open. Okay, so I get to, do I go first or do I go second? Let's go second. I just want to see what he's playing. I like going second because I want to see what they're playing. And my hand is so bricky, I got nothing. <laughs> um, but never say never. You know what? Maybe heart of the cards and I'll draw into something good. But I got two transcendent wings, a detonate, and a one for one. And a... Karibo that I can special summon a Link Karibo. Hopefully if I draw into another Nothing. Hmm I guess we can do Nightmare Phoenix by doing So we'll do we'll summon Rainbow Karibo. Why did I lose? Once per turn, dirty treasure, mystery one face of monster, and if they do, and okay, then I'm gonna one for one. Okay, so he has a burn card that each player must pay 500 life points per card to normal summon, special summon, set, or activate cards from his or her hand. I'm going to get rid of that with Nightmare Phoenix right now. Um, I'm waiting for him. He's probably going to stop my activation, my one for one, to, so I can special summon. Um, but I don't like being burned. I don't like, I don't like that. I've, I've played stall burn decks, and I'm not gonna lie, I play stall decks, I play a Destiny board and an Exodia deck, and they both run Mystic Minds, and I know when I play Mystic Minds, oh, he MST'd me. I'm pretty sure I'll still get the effect, though. Yeah, I do. So, um, I need a light and a dark, so we'll just get a Karibo. I like having light and dark in my graveyard just because if Black Lesser Soldier or Chaos Dragon comes out, I can just automatically special summon them. So yeah, I'm gonna go with Nightmare Phoenix. I'm gonna discard one of my Transcendent Wings. I don't really need it. Which one shall okay, once per turn during each player's end phase or one phase on monster if they do inflict damage to the opponent able to have their rid of We're gonna get rid of this. I don't really mind the burn card right now. I can get rid of that later. And then I'm gonna go into battle phase and attack him for the 19. <laughs> yeah, because I'm not taking <laughs> half of my life points. Oh half of my attack points. And then I'll end my phase. So it looks like he's just playing a really a burn deck. Um, he hasn't summoned any monsters yet. Mystic Mind, see, so... I'm not gonna be able to attack at all. At all. Like, I run Mystic Mind and I know. So basically what I'm gonna do is...
I'm gonna have to wait. I'm gonna have to wait for... He's not gonna attack me, so I'm gonna have to wait for a Karibu to come out, and then I'm gonna detonate it. Hopefully I can get a Karibu and my tokens, or uh, multiply and get the tokens, and then detonate and destroy all his cards, and then I should be good. But, as of right now, we're gonna end, we're gonna end, we're gonna end the phase, see if any monsters come out. Um, I don't think so. If you play Mystic Mind, it is a stall deck to the fullest. And wow, I lied. He brought out a monster. Oh, what? If I this card, kind of destroy my battle or effects, you take no damage. Uh, I evolve this card at the end of the battle. So this card out of shuffle all of your opponents. Graveyard into dead once per turn if your opponent draws a card and flick a thousand damage. Okay. Transcendent wings, I guess. Send him. Oh, I gotta send both. I did it wrong. I did it wrong. I think I'm gonna lose this duel. He's just gonna stall me out. He is just gonna stall me out. Must be social summer or transcendent during your phone's battle phase. You can treat it as a car. So when you attack position with me. Possible if you do if Okay, you know what? That's fine. It's a burn deck. He's gonna stall me out and my life points are gonna go all the way down and I'm gonna be sad, but it's fine. We're gonna end phase. I've never played this deck. I've never Played a stall deck like this, but you always learn new things. See, he didn't even play this turn. Can't attack. Missing my soul on the field. I can't do nothing. Let's see what I can special summon. You know what? I can't. I can do this. Just to get plays in, because... No, I I guess I can't. <laughs> I-I don't know why his effect didn't go off. So his effect, my Nightmare Unicorn, is if this card is in summon, you can discard one card, then target one card until returning to the deck. Then, if this card was co-linked with this effect, uh, was activated, you can draw one card. So basically, I thought I can discard my card in my hand to get rid of Mystic Mind, but for some reason, it didn't go off. So I'm kind of confused, and I'm trying to play around this Mystic Mind, because I know how, or I at least try to... Ugh, sorry guys. I at least try to, because I, like I said, I do run it in two of my decks, but... This guy is just stalling me out. And I know the feeling. Because I, in my Exodia deck, I do not let you do anything. Um, You know, we're end phase. We're going to save that Fluta Summon Karibo. Wait for a, miss, uh, a multiply. Whoa. Yeah, so we're going to... Then there it is. So what we're gonna do? I'm gonna take a thousand damage just to wait. I think I might take damage for every token. Let's see. Five hundred. I. Five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty. I'll be left with five hundred life points left if I do this because I just took five for Fluta Summon Karibo. I'll special summon a Karibo. That's another 500. So I'll be at 3,000. Or 3,500. Wait. 
Oh, I didn't take any. Okay. But I'm gonna take damage for this multiply. Tribute this. Oh, okay. I didn't take any damage for my token, so that's a relief. Now we're just gonna link away. We are going to link away. Uh, we're gonna get we uh apprentice right here. Then we're gonna get Abermax again. And then we're gonna get Union Carrier. And then we're gonna get a Link Karibo. And then we're gonna get. No, I'm just kidding. I'm surprised he didn't have a Nibiru, because if he had a Nibiru, all my monsters would have been gone already. Um, and I still can't attack because of Mystic Mind, so I'm just gonna end my phase, but at least I got something on my board, and we're trying to get past this Mystic Mind. And I'm just losing life points. This is crazy. So he shuffled my whole... Alright, now what I'm gonna do, because I got detonate back. So I'm gonna end my phase. Hopefully I draw into the Karibo. I'm gonna detonate that Mystic Mine, and we're gonna attack for game. Like, that's, that's what it's gonna be. Yeah, let's do it. What's in his graveyard? <laughs> wow. This is actually a... A multiply. Like I said, can attack. So we're gonna wait for the Karibo. Do the detonate and hopefully attack for game. He's stalling me out, I'm at 25. What happened? Oh no! <laughs> Got rid of my Abermax. Oh man. Oh man. So what we'll do right here is, we're gonna get Nightmare Unicorn because I don't like that Lava Golem on my field. And we are going to... We're gonna get a Link Karibo. Oh wait. Nightmare Phoenix? Right here. Let's get rid... Why can't I get rid of the Mystic Mine? I thought, okay, so... If this card is linked summon, you can discard one card and target one spell and trap on your uh your one spell and trap your opponent controls and destroy it. Why can I not destroy this mystic line? This guy, you guys, I'm losing this duel. <laughs> I thought I did everything I could, and I am for sure losing this duel. Try to work my way with, uh, my way around it, but it's just not happening. And I think I'm going to end it with two duels today. We're running at the 23 minute mark, so I don't want the video to be too long. Um, I enjoyed it. You guys saw how I got to play my Karibo deck a little bit. If you think there's anything better I can do in the deck, let me know in the comments what I can add, what I should take away, what Link Monsters I should put in, what uh, Exceed, uh, everything like that I should put in. Or let me know what kind of deck you want me to use and I'll try to build one. Um, but I'm about to lose this duel. I thought I was gonna win. I'm about to lose this one. I just wonder why he doesn't have build barrier or anything. So I wonder why I can't 
destroy his mystic mind. And kind of confusing to me. But nonetheless, I had fun. I had fun with you guys. Thank you. If you were watching this, thank you again. This is only my second video on YouTube. If you haven't seen my first one, I was opening a box, a booster box of Roaring Skies, and we got some amazing cards with some amazing artwork. And this guy beat me. Do I want to activate Clear Karibo in the graveyard? Yes. What is he doing? Yeah. Yeah, I draw one card. If it's a monster, you get special summon. Okay, hopefully I get into a monster. But like I was saying, I was opening a box of Roar Skies. We pulled some amazing cards with some amazing artworks. And if you want to see the next, I lost the duel. If you want to see the next um, half of that box opening, I think I'm gonna post it on Wednesday um, because I lost my train of thought. If you want to see that video on Wednesday, it's going to be there. Second half of Roaring Skies. Hopefully we pull more Rayquazas, a Shaman, a Dragonite, everything like that. But as for today, I had fun dueling with my Karibo deck. Like I said, let me know if there's anything better I could do with it. Peace out. Much love. Thank you.